everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a sustainable brand haul. This video is going to feature Tentree, which is a Canadian sustainable brand that makes eco-friendly clothes that are super comfy and cozy. On top of that, for every item that they sell or that you buy, they will plant 10 trees. Plus, every one of their like little clothing tags come with a tree code. And so if you register it, you can actually check out like the impact that your purchase made on the environment, which I think is really, really special and definitely unique to Tentree. This is the first look, super easy, super casual, a little bit more on the tomboy vibe that I love so much. First, we're gonna talk about these tensile pants. So yes, Tentree makes a lot of their clothes with tensile because tensile is an eco-friendly fabric. They also use a lot of other sustainable and recycled fabrics, which, is why it's such an eco-friendly brand. These pants are in a size small. I would say that Tentry sizing is true to size on the edge of being a little bit bigger because these ones fit me like perfectly. They're so comfy and flowy, but I feel like the waistband's a little bit bigger than what I would expect with a normal small. So I really love the style of the pant because it has like a drawstring waistband but it also has like a little jogger style elastics at the bottom but they're not like super tight so you still get this like elongated flowy pant leg without it being super wide so on the actual drawstring there's the tabs with the tentry logo which i think is a nice little touch of color because these are black pants the pockets for these ones are like on the back side it will definitely fit your phone but it also helps with like the pants looking so slim along the waist because sometimes when you have pants like this in pockets in the front it can make you look frumpy but they did a really great design job on these to make it as like flattering as possible and then this is a t-shirt from them they have a bunch of really cute t-shirt designs i'm wearing a size medium in this one and i find that their crew neck is a little bit on the wider side which is ideal for me i love crew neck t-shirts that are a little bit more relaxed in terms of the sleeve length i'd say it's average it's not too short not too long and i got the one with the tentry like mountain logo on it it kind of like reminds me of like these vintage t logos from back in the day so that's why i chose this one again i just wrapped it to tuck in front how i normally do it but this is how the size medium would fit me if it's untucked all right so for a more sporty look i changed up the tensile pants to their sweatpants these ones i would say size true to size i think the small fits me perfectly i'm wearing them as a higher rise pant right now like pulled them up and tightened the drawstring but you can definitely wear them lower i just find that when you're wearing them higher then the inseam for me at least fits me perfectly i'm 5'5 five five. you can use that as a reference so they're really comfy breathable and like just perfect for i don't know like walking your dog or going to grab groceries i paired it with sneakers just to give you like the full sporty vibe so these ones are actually like a navy marled blue i love the little specks in it and again it has like the same tentry drawstring here very very comfy so i actually got the sweatpants in this light gray as well because i wanted to match with the t-shirt for like almost as like 90s like workout vibe look so for these ones even though i'm wearing a size small i would roll them up like this rolling them up a little bit i think changes the shape so that it looks better on me at least and to show you the gray up close, this is like pretty much a matte gray. So it doesn't have those speckles like the navy blue ones did. So I just wanted to show you what the tee would look like with a blazer and shorts and some sandals, which are my go-to summer looks. The tee is really, really comfy under the blazer. And because of the more relaxed opening for the crew neck, it just looks really nice under the lapel because sometimes you can get t-shirts that like bunch up underneath but the material of the tentry one is perfect i also just wanted to show you quickly how easy it is to dress up a gray tee so just white pants high-waisted pants so you can roll it up and it looks a little bit more cropped and fitted with some fun white mules or you can do something a little bit more casual and throw on a cardigan and switch out the mules for a pair of flip-flops this cardigan is actually a Tentree cardigan. It's made of 100% organic cotton. It is like the perfect summer cardigan because it's super, super lightweight, but still like gives you a little bit of like substance when you are a little bit cold, probably on a summer night. So in this cardigan, I'm wearing a size medium. 
I wanted to make sure because it's like an open cardigan like this that it would drape as much as it would in the front. And the really cool part of it is that it has like a little mountain design on the back of it. And it also is like basically like a little circle in terms of the shape. This is the material up close. You can really see what I mean by how lightweight it is, but still like because it's organic cotton, it's super comfy and breathable and will definitely keep you warm when you need it in the summer. So for me, I love wearing shorts and a sweater, especially like hoodie and denim shorts. It's just like that really like tomboy vibe with that given that it's not like a 40 degree summer day, but I do usually bring a sweater with me because you never know like what the AC is like inside a place or if it's gonna cool down at night. So this is the hoodie in a size small. I really like the fit of this hoodie. The neck is really, really open. So if you followed me before and watched any of my like sweatpants and hoodie videos, you know that the like neck area of a hoodie is really important. Like I need it to come down over my head easily and for it not to like be stuck around my neck. So this sweater is actually made with organic cotton, recycled polyester, and tencel. So it's very soft. You can kind of see the material up close here. The inside of the hood is actually lined too, so it's not fuzzy inside. I think it's actually a very smart idea because sometimes the fuzziness can degrade. So this is a size small on me. I'm going to show you what the size medium of the Ten Tree hoodie looks like on as well. So this is what the medium looks like. It's definitely baggier, longer arms, and the like hood and the neck area is a little bit lower. For me, it's not a huge difference. I mean, if you're a size medium, order size medium, I think true to size is fine for these. It's a little bit oversized enough that I think you'll be comfy without having to order like way too big. Similar to the sweatpants, it's like a flat gray and it has a really nice message on it. So the hoodie works with jean shorts or bike shorts. As you know, I am obsessed with bike shorts this summer. The medium actually gets long enough that I feel comfortable and I feel like if I stretch it a little bit, it will become a little bit looser around the hip area, which is what I want. So you can actually dress up the tensile black pants really easily, just simply with a like tighter tee or a tighter tank top and then just throw on some low heels. It almost acts like a like dressed up pair of joggers. And if it is a nighttime date, you can throw on a really light jacket. This is actually a tensile jacket too, so it matches the fabric of the pants and really looks like it's a set. I really like this one because it doesn't have like a closure. It really is like this like open robe cardigan feeling jacket, but it has a collar and it's a little bit more structured. So this is it a little bit closer up. You can definitely see that it is the same material as the pants. It's tensile, super breathable. So even though it's black and it's a long sleeve, it will work in the summer because it's just super flowy and very breathable. So this is the fabric up close. You can see the lapel is very soft and it just continues on and just drapes down and it has two pockets. I am wearing a size small in this. So I'd say size true to size. And here's another casual look with the cardigan and the tensile pants. This is a really easy thing to throw on. So next up is this green tensile lysol button up. I did get this one in an extra large because I saw how it fit on the model and I knew I was not gonna really wear it as a regular button up. It's more going to be a cover up slash like little jacket kind of thing. And I think the extra large fits perfectly on me. Like the shoulders really aren't that much over, but the whole body is super flowy and long. I chose to pair it with the black tensile pants and a tank and sandals because this is another way that I would wear these two pieces. So this is the tensile material up close. You can kind of see that there's like natural fading that might happen with it because it's like almost like a lived in material, which is why I love tensile so much. So it does have a pocket here and the little buttons are wooden. So it's a really earthy vibe there. So depending on how flowy you want it, I definitely would say size up on this top. So another reason to order this top like up a couple sizes is so that it can look like this with bike shorts. So as you know, I love bike shorts and I love it when you have like a flowy top on it with just like a hint of the bike short showing. And that's what I get with the extra large in this one. I think that I would probably just wear it down like this or even tuck in the like inner flap of the button up so that you just get a little bit extra leg there depending on what you feel like. Or you could even wear it with a bike short tank top and it over like I did with the previous outfit. All right, so as you know, I've been trying to 
dabble more in dresses and Tenshi makes this t-shirt dress that honestly I think it's one of the most flattering t-shirt dresses I have ever tried on because I usually like them oversized longer and a little bit billowy but when I do that like and I usually size up then like the arm and like top part is too frumpy and I just like end up looking like a box but I really like the proportions that they've done with this one the sleeves are a little bit shorter but you still have like a really long column of the t-shirt dress but there is a seam that basically comes from the sides and then comes inwards that's why you still get the billowy part because they've added more fabric and longer fabric in the back but it almost like hugs you in so when I'm standing there's like a very like flattering like billowy shape that comes with it. So this t-shirt dress is actually made with recycled polyester, organic cotton, and tensile. So that's why you get this amazing like feel with this fabric. It's like light, but there's like still substance in it. And that's why you still get this beautiful draping. So I am wearing a size small on this. I definitely recommend true to size in this one. I love how the small fits on me. So some other looks that could work well with the dress is like the green top just as like a little jacket or like almost like just like an overcoat for nighttime, daytime. Just add a little different color to it if you want. You can even tie it around your waist even if you're not going to wear it just to break things up a bit and to show your like waistline if you wanted to. I think it looks really interesting with like the breakup of the black and the green and the lifestyle as like an added fabric to like the t-shirt dress is a fun look too. And for a softer nighttime look, I think that the dress would look really cute with the lightweight cardigan and matching up the white with some white mules on the feet. And another option for this dress is to put on the black tensile jacket. I think it makes it look a lot more professional. And in terms of like the shape and the flowiness of the dress and jacket and the length of it, it makes me feel and look a lot taller. And I kept the white mules on. I think this is a really smart look. All right, so I chose a rain jacket to test out for you guys too because I'm always on the hunt for like a more lightweight, breathable rain jacket. Sometimes rain jackets I find are just like too rubbery. Um, but the Tentry one, I am happy to say, is pretty lightweight and I feel like it's going to be one of the more breathable rain jackets that I have. I am wearing a size medium because I was reading the dimensions and I knew I wanted to wear sweaters underneath it for fall and maybe even winter or spring. So I went with the medium. I actually think the small would have been too small. Like with the rain jacket, I definitely want more room. So this is what it looks like closer up. It has a nice like natural waist on its own. So it's quite flattering even for a rain jacket. And the hood is actually not detachable, FYI. But I mean, with most rain jackets, you are going to need a hood. It has like almost a hidden zipper pocket on the sides because you can't really see it otherwise. And the inside is fully lined with a very like comfy, breathable material. So I decided to style the rain jacket with the gray Tentry tee and some jeans just to show you what it would look like with a jean outfit that I normally wear. So now I'm wearing a super lightweight knit sweater from Tentry. I know knitwear is kind of like iffy for me in the summer because it can be really, really like hot and itchy, but this one's actually made of 100% organic cotton and it's so breathable. I think it's actually more breathable than the t-shirts um, because of like the way the stripes are. I'll show you up close. I just want to show you how relaxed and easy fitting the sweater is. I am wearing a size small, which I rarely go true to size for sweaters, but with this, I think it just almost works as like a sweater and t-shirt kind of look. So I went with true to size and I'm very happy with how it hangs. This is the material up close. It seemed like it was gonna be see-through when it was hanging, but now that I put it on, like you honestly don't see anything. I was thinking it might be see-through because of these stripes here, but it is so not. Like you just don't see anything. It actually makes, that's what makes it so breathable and amazing. I'd highly recommend this sweater if you're looking for a really nice, like breezy, summer like cover up even and for something that's a little bit more effortless and i think like a brunch time look i would pair this knit with wider leg pants and the mules i think it's just super effortless and easy but still looks a little bit more dressed up i also have this scarf that i wanted to try out because you know what when it's cooler maybe end of summer going into fall like this is going to be amazing this is 100 percent organic cotton it has this like gorgeous gorgeous pattern to it so you can even wear it like over a tank 
and shorts in the summer. So instead of bringing like a jacket or a sweater, this can be like almost like a cover up. But then in the fall, you can probably just wear it as an actual scarf. And then just have like the fringe show. And for those of you who are like really sensitive to wool and stuff, this is organic cotton but it would definitely still keep you warm, I think, because you're like wrapping multiple layers and it's all bunched up. So it's a great option for like an all season scarf. The material up close, you can see that it's like beautiful and super, super comfy. Like when I bunch it up like this, it's very malleable, which means that's going to be really, really like easy to wrap into a scarf. And that's a wrap. I hope that you enjoyed this Ten Tree Haul, a sustainable company that's Canadian and they plant 10 trees for every item sold. So don't forget that because I think that's so amazing. So if you have any questions, leave them down below. I do have a 20% off discount code for you all to use. So that will be left down there as well. Hope you like the video, subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you very soon.